It's day 97. Of the 29th year and beyond. And it's Thanksgiving Day, so we want to say Happy, Happy Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. Uh, and that's what I wanted to talk about, uh, just real simply. Uh, as you share your life together, there will be ups, there will be downs, there will be achievements, there will be disappointments. There'll be all of those things. There'll be things that you acquire that you wanted and things that maybe you have not. Yeah, I agree. Uh, but with all that said, one of the things that we've learned is no matter what you're striving for and no matter what you want to achieve and plan to achieve, learn to really be thankful for what you have. I agree. I'm thankful for a husband that loves me. I'm thankful for a husband that loves God first. I'm thankful for a husband that is a nurturer to our children. I'm thankful for a family that is um, goes well beyond the means of what family could possibly do. I'm thankful for the support that I get from my friends and my family. I'm thankful just being able to exist and enjoy the moment. Wow. And I would say 100% uh, I concur with all of that. Um, you know, <clears throat> I think in this life and in this world, we focus on things that we don't have. That's right. Things that have not happened or things that we wish would happen. Um, and you can spend a lot of time, energy, and effort on looking at what you don't have or what you haven't experienced mm -hmm. or who's not a part of your life. But I just think that it's much more meaningful and uh, definitely, fun, I would say, helping you to enjoy the journey when you really look at what you do have and truly being thankful. You know, having an attitude of gratitude, uh, I believe, has the ability to change the trajectory of how you experience life mm -hmm. and how you're able to be able to love the person that you're with and enjoy what you share together. Uh, Gail and I have, uh, you know, like I said, experienced highs, lows, and, and, and things in between. And, uh, you know, we've had to uh, deal with so much that the world has thrown at us, and we had to deal with some things that we've thrown at one another. Oh, yeah. But with that said, we've learned the benefit and the value of being thankful to God for who's in our lives and how they're in mm -hmm. our lives and, and what we possess and uh, realizing that, there, of course, you know, it may sound cliche, but it's true. There are so many people who would love to take places with where we are or with yeah. where you are, mm -hmm. you know, no matter what your circumstance or challenges are. And so... Uh, there is someone who has a much much more challenging experience, someone who may have less, someone, I mean, all of those things. And I just think that uh, uh, it's just so much, so much more beneficial to be thankful, to acknowledge the blessings and to enjoy those blessings as you continue to strive for other things, as you continue to work towards your goals mm -hmm. and your objectives. But realize, as we shared in one of the previous vlogs, it's not about the destination, it's about, about, the, journey. about the journey. It's about the journey. And I decided years ago to focus on the journey, but also to focus on the good stuff, not the bad stuff. I mean, because it's so easy to elevate, well, this is wrong and that's wrong, and that person has this flaw, and that person has that flaw. No. If you focus on the good things that people have, the things that you can be thankful for, you will find yourself in a much better place because you can drag yourself down just by one negative thought, but you can take one lovely thought. Like, for instance, I love the color of that shirt mm. that you're wearing. That may be the person that you despise and you don't really particularly care for, but I love the color of that shirt. That can just elevate them, and then in the same, it elevates you. So to be thankful for the small things in life. Be thankful for... I would say all things, even the challenging things, because mm -hmm. those are opportunities that uh, afford us uh, growth. Uh, we may not grow, but they do present opportunities for which we can grow. They do. And for that, I'm thankful. So on this Thanksgiving Day, uh, from our family to yours, from our heart to yours, be thankful because I guarantee you, if you're listening to me and Gail at mm -hmm. this moment, you have something to be thankful for. Happy thanks. Giving day. Until tomorrow, if the Lord says the same. Bye.